Hello everyone, this is Chen Mai from Makeado Clinic. Welcome back to my channel. Today I am going to discuss something about which is one of the crucial point which I which I what I am going to you know uh, tell you. Uh, this is particularly I mean this video is particularly about the old bullets. I mean bullets which were having CB point system like five uh, your 500 cc uh, cb point or 350 uh, standard or the deluxe model or the campus model or 535 uh, your lightning city bike all those breeds were having C cb point so the particular video is actually for the cb point motorcycles right but it is not necessary you can you should not use this product for other bikes in fact new breed has got more complex electronics and electrical so of course definitely you should use it but this video is particularly about the cb point reason is that the coil system what they were giving earlier were different right so it was kind of open so when you used to service the bike when you used to have a you know when you used to wash the bike when you used to ride the bike in the rains at that time you were having a lot of problem or in fact you still have the i mean many riders are having these bikes so you still have such problem when you ride uh, the bike in rains or when you wash the bike so electrical problem is the most uh, you know uh what we can say that uh, you have already faced a lot right so that is the reason that i am making this uh, you know video because particularly the, this spare part particular this spare part is only available in these bikes that's the reason i am making such a video only dedicated you know for this particular bike so the you know the st coil used to get you know i mean still st coil of course so when you wash the bike the water goes in and then uh, there is a problem of you know current right so to avoid that what can what what remedy we can do this remedy basically uh, and this process is uh, applied on many bikes by many brands but older generations were not having such kind of a product that is the reason i'm making this video issue so let's check out the video and have uh, you know uh, look at uh, look at the spare part how uh, and the process how do i perform it so this is the bottle coil which you must have seen most of the time you have to use uh, spatula or uh, popsicle stick and earbud anything soft rather than using any metal this is the dielectric grease it's quite expensive but it's a very good product to save your time so looking at the cost i think uh, uh, it's worth to buy anyways so most of the greases are quite costly in automobile and an important thing which i would like to uh, mention over here all the greases are not same all are having different application and different purpose and different grades so you have to pluck out the cable from the uh, coil and of course you have to remove the boot which is a kind of a protective boot to avoid the water entry but after some time it's get it gets you know brittle so just insert the cap and apply some layer of dielectric grease on the point uh, this video even though i have made particularly for old bikes but of course you can use it for new bikes as well in fact new bikes are more complex so you have to take a little chunk out of it and you have to apply on the terminal or the point you can apply it on the connector you can apply on the issue connectors as well wherever electrical contact is there you can apply so this is just a demonstration which i am showing you even evenly apply in this crease on the point on the wire point this is basically non conductive so we don't have to worry about it after applying the grease you just have to apply on the cavity on the uh, point which is there inside the uh, ignition coil which is which has got a cavity so i just bent it a little bit so i can have an access i'm using particularly this uh, earbud so it will not damage anything metal contact can damage the surface or the contact of the coil so you just avoid all those things it is not necessary you have to use earbud you can use anything but soft or non metallic just apply it evenly inside the cavity once you are done with it 
then reinsert the cable and apply some uh, on the boot as well just press it properly so this will help you or this will prevent prevent water entry or water deposition I am going to apply some grease uh, from inner side of the cap or the boot. Remember every grease has got different application or the purpose and the grade. When I am saying grease doesn't mean uh, anything is common. You have to use only such products which are made for such kind of an application. It is not a hub grease where you can use or not an AP3 also you can use over here. So don't misunderstand in that case. Now I have done the job, uh, coil job. Now I am just applying some, since I have the access, so I am applying some uh, dielectric grease on those terminals, coil terminals. Older coil, as I mentioned, was open type of. So that is the reason I am applying here as well. And it has got a boot. So after applying that grease on the terminal, you can just insert the cap on the top of the terminal. Once you are done, then you are done with this job. As I said, you can apply dielectric grease even to the spark plug cap. Uh, once you fix the uh, spark plug on the head and other connectors as well, wherever there is uh, the wherever connectors are open. Some connectors are having rubber seals. But uh, generally, I am using this uh, dielectric grease um, uh, everywhere. Wherever I feel the electricity or electric current may, I may lose it. So I apply over there. So this is how you have to apply dielectric grease on electrical uh, components, which will not cause any problem because of I mean, which will help you to keep the vehicle in running condition and. Uh, because of water it will not get off it's a very uh, simple method but product is very important very simple method and uh, tools you need to apply grease on the terminals guys thanks for watching if, uh, and i hope you have enjoyed this video uh, if you want uh, the, you know support the channel then you can definitely donate uh, you you can use the link which is given in the description for the donation purpose and you can uh, donate now for the channel uh, of course uh, for the product i have already mentioned that i have uploaded my link over there where from where you can purchase the product and you can apply it over there it's a very important product because because of that when you are on the ride you will not have any kind of a problem so thanks for watching and have a great day